ボールを引き伸ばすってことですね。そう、ボールをこう押さえて、固定して、で、ボールを変形させることによってこういうブレ玉が。ブレ玉が生じて。ああ、っていう必要です。なんだっけ、何かというのですけど。はい、じゃあ
Okay. Let's take a look at the, the other five players. So we got uh, this guy. Elvres, 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 Elvis, Elvis, right? This guy's called Elvis. This guy with the ponytail. He's got some um, Sky Ranch. Uh, I don't know. Some type of. Uh, not sure what that skill is. Excuse my Japanese. It's not that very good, but. Um, but he's got the. Mexican player offense 20% off for the team skill. His skill, I'm not quite sure. I think it's like a home, like a Rucha, Rucha, Rucha. Maybe a defensive skill. I think. Not sure. Uh, he's got 15,000 offense, 13,000 defense, 14,000 physical, and then the next guy here we got. Uh, Suarez, Su Suarez, 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 this guy Suarez. He's got some tackle skill, S skill. And then this guy here, we saw his um, animation already. Lopez, he's got the Swingu Shiki DDT Volley. Some yeah, swing, swing formation DDT Volley. They combine wrestling with uh, soccer. I, if you guys watch the uh, animation the comic not 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 the animation but the the comic and then we got this guy here the big dude uh uh what's his name again i forgot let me take a whole look oh yeah garcia garcia he's got the big bang shot you guys saw the animation uh to be honest those animations are so cool like, oh, and I think the the one that Alves has is the first animation, the one after uh, Lopez. It's like a one-two scale, I think. The one that uh, this guy has, the the ponytail guy. Yeah, Al 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 Alvarez, El Ruvez, yeah. And then finally, this guy, uh, Saragoza. He's got some kind of tackle skill, S skill. Yeah, so these guys are like the five soldiers of the Aztec Sun. Yeah, they're the midfielders and forwards. Lopez, Sergosa, Garcia, Alves, Suarez. Yeah, and they call them the Aerial Lucha Soccer style. And then they combine Mexican wrestling with soccer. That's why you see them. That you see the DDT. DDT is a move in wrestling. That's why that move is called DDT. And they throw him into the sky and stuff, yeah. Pretty, pretty cool. The animations, I really like them, to be honest. They're really cool. Yeah. Finally, some new players in this in this game. Not uh, recycled players. So, the problem is, it's going to be like the Dutch uh, Dream Fest. Uh, Dream Collection, I mean. The rates are going to be pretty tough to get all the players and you need to activate these skills with all the players so I don't know if the rates will be as good as like the Dutch Dream Collection remembers uh, Last year it was really easy to get the SSR I had like four of them I got three or four of them Yeah, four I believe Three, I got three I got Brian and the other two during that one So maybe they'll, they'll improve the the, the rates but the problem is in global in global version are we gonna get these Mexican guys plus Pascal and Hernandez so that's gonna be eight characters so I don't know how they're gonna do it but we'll find out very soon uh, after clap uh, clap stations live stream I guess the English live stream and yeah, I got more to go over in Japanese version, so let's take a look here at the news. Yeah, this video is going to be a bit long. Yeah, so Dream Collection, already talked about it. And then we got Challenge Road again. EX stage is back, so I, I'm i guessing we might need... We're, we're going to for sure need the South American team. 
but I'm not sure if they're gonna put a EX stage where we require the Me these Mexican guys. Yeah, that would be because they have done that before with Falcon. We needed Falcon. Well, we didn't have to have the Dream Collection Falcon, but it was right before the challenge road. So I don't know. Maybe they're gonna do that again. So. Oh, actually, wait. It already says here. EX3. Dream Collection players. Are needed. Right here. EX Road 3. And then the EX World Run and 2. EX, EX1 and 2 are the South American players. That we've been farming. Oh my god. And then EX3 is going to be the Dream Collection players that we need. Oh man. Mexico. Mexican players. Holy crap. Wow. So I wonder how many we'll need. <laughs> wow. Wow, 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 wow. And then we got a new raid. Natureza. Um, it's got a high speed pass. It's gonna be a passing skill, so pretty much Naturaliza is complete with this skill. He's he, he's got everything pretty much. He's got one two. He's got tackle. He's got pass. So pretty good. And then yeah. Also, Oraren has a passing skill as well. Precise pass. So he's getting buffed. And wow, and this is great news right here. Finally. The first generation Dream Collection guys have finally have the passive skill. Diaz, Natraza, and Masuyama. So I wonder what 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 the 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 passive skill is gonna be. Yeah. And then we got additional players that are getting a buff, the passive skill buff. It's the Dream Collection Tachibana Twins The Red Toughness Type Nita The one with the... The... Hayabusa Folly one The one that I have <laughs> uh, This one is uh... Salvador Gintelli Sal uh, Sa Salvador Gintelli The Red Gintelli is getting a buff The Red Falcon is getting a buff The Passive, passive Skill the one from the Halloween gacha, and then we got uh, my, my best buddy Pierre, the Halloween Pierre is getting a buff, passive, passive skill buff, and also Napoleon is getting a passive skill buff. Alright, that's great. A lot of stuff coming up. Even more, I'm not done yet, even more. We got more coming up. Look at this, 10 million downloads campaign is here oh my god so almost one year and then in a month in less than a month this game will be released for one year Japanese version and they claim they already got 10 million downloads <laughs> I don't know how many how much percentage of that is uh, our rerolls <laughs> and and people who have multiple accounts <laughs> I have an I have an account in my secondary device which I don't play anymore and let's take a look. So it's gonna be this campaign. It's gonna give out a lot of stuff. Login bonus. There's gonna be a SSR black ball. Uh, those evil cards, evil drills, Roberto books, uh, and there's some. There's also gonna be uh, this metal thing that we, we they're gonna give us, and then which we can exchange for an SSR ticket, and a bunch of other awesome prizes, of course, UR coach cards, etc., etc. And then these tickets, uh, yeah, can be used to exchange an SSR uh, player, of course. Let's see what else have we got here. 
And then the event mission. Okay, you got a daily missions that we got to do. So starting this Friday, May 18th, we're going to be very, very busy in Japanese version. Yeah, and then we got the big success, great success. And then there's going to be higher drop rates for the EVO drills. Because they expect us all to use our dream balls and get all new characters. So we're going to need a lot of these drills. And then stamina cost is halved. It's 50% off for sh scenarios starting this Friday as well until June 6th. Wow. Holy crap. A lot of stuff. That's a lot of good stuff right here. So what do you guys think? What do you guys think? Are you guys going to do the, the Mexico Espadas? Uh, dream collection are you guys gonna pull or not or wait till dream fest or even the world cup event or one year anniversary event i mean they got so many things going on this summer it's it's crazy absolutely crazy and yeah global version we'll see if we're gonna get all these characters at once eight characters that's gonna be two goalkeepers a uh, bunch of uh, midfielders and forwards from a Mexican team and then Pascal and then yeah so I don't know I only have 107 dream balls in my Japanese account I might do it because I really like that those moves those animation but obviously it's gonna be very hard to collect all the Mexican players and I can get a bunch of free dream balls from here, which I haven't done yet. The scenario. So we'll see what happens. Alright, so tell me what you think. Uh, comment down below. Give us a thumbs up. Hope you guys like these videos. Yeah, I hope I provided enough info for those that missed, missed the live stream. But I mean, you can obviously go back and watch your live stream. But I like to give my point of view uh, of, of things in this game, of course. And yeah, that's it. Please give me the thumbs up. Subscribe the channel. Comment down below. Support our affiliates in the description. Click on those links, please. Check them out. Uh, our sponsors are down there. Affiliates down there. And yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys maybe in the next live stream or... Probably I'll do another video before that. But. And also, if you play Dragon Ball Legends, please check out my other videos. Yeah. And join the Facebook group as well. Everything is in the description below. Alright. I gotta go. Take it easy, guys.